Poppy Playtime is scary. And so I thought, I'm going to remake every mob into Poppy Playtime characters in Minecraft. Oh, this is gonna be interesting. Hear me out. I'm gonna turn the zombie into Poppy. Now I know Poppy is like a really tiny doll. So using a zombie doesn't really make sense, but please just bear with me. So Poppy is literally completely white. She has really bright red hair. I wanna give the hair a little bit more depth to make her hair tie. Now what's left is to make her huge ponytails. We need to make her eyes. Give her some lips. Oh my gosh, with these shoulders, it kind of looks really buff. Uh, this is the fun part. That's to add the tutu. I don't even know how big I'm supposed to make this thing. Okay, I'd say that's big enough. Uh, what did I make? This looks awful. And with that, we are done with Poppy. Let's see what we get. And oh, so as you can see, an adult zombie doesn't really quite fit Poppy. However, if we were to make a baby zombie, get out the way. Look at that. Now that's Poppy. Oh my gosh, this works so well. Oh, your legs. It's kind of going through your tutu, but that is Poppy. 100% that's Poppy. Oh, this turned out so good. Not so much this. Oh, just let me make a ton of poppies. Oh my gosh. Look at all the poppies run. Oh, that one's staring at me. This is what we call Poppy Supremacy. So this was the exact reason as to why I used a zombie. So I can literally make a baby zombie and turn it into this. Now, this is all great and all. What if I had them all chasing me? Oh my gosh. Oh my God. Look at all the poppies chasing me. There's so many of them. Please, poppy, don't do this. Oh, there's so many of them. They're about to kill me. I'm really about to die. Please, no. Oh, okay. And there's Poppy. Up next, we have Kissy Missy. Now, I've made Huggy Wuggy before on my Google Translate video. I mean, just look at that face. Oh my gosh. And we use an Enderman for him, so I think it'd be best if I use an Enderman for Kissy Missy. I want to make the body shape a little bit more accurate. Let's work a bit more on the head shape. I'd say that's about the head shape. Shrink these arms a tiny bit and give her her yellow hands. Crack her legs a little bit and then give her her feet. So if you've ever played Chapter 2 of Poppy Playtime, Kissy Missy doesn't seem to be a person who wants to attack you, and so she never shows her teeth. For now, a smile should just be fine. I don't know how this is gonna work because these eyelashes are just not good at all. To make it look a little bit less weird, I ended up making the eyes significantly bigger. Let's just add the bow tie. Kissy Missy is done. I'm terrified how this how this looks in Minecraft. Only one place to look. Oh boy, here we go. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Um, hello, Kissy Wissy. Wissy. Sorry, Missy. Honestly, this is a little bit lighthearting because Huggy Wookie looked terrifying. This was a bit change of pace, but it's still kind of terrifying to look at. Overall, pretty happy with how this turned out. Although I am very curious as how she'll contribute to the next chapter of the game. I feel like it's a must to do this. I'm gonna look at all of your guys' faces. Hello. Oh, that's not right. You have an extendo neck. Why are you just standing there? Okay, never mind. Just look at their necks extend. That is not supposed to happen at all. I'm not afraid of any of y'all. Oh my god. There's so many. Please. No. <laughs> Put her in a cave. So there's definitely some issues with this mob still, considering every time I look at it, its next goes extendo. But I made her and she's in Minecraft. Watch, it's about to break its neck. Boom. Oh no, that's not right. Are we just having a moment as we just stare at each other? You're really just shaky right now. Oh, there's two of them at me. Oh no. All right, well, thank you, Kissy Missy. I'll see you later. Okay, I know I've made mommy long legs before and I'm gonna do it again. But the reason for that is because, well, I... no, this was not supposed to happen. She didn't turn out too well. Plus there's like a creepier variant of her and I think I can make this even more creepy than I did last time. Surprisingly enough, Mommy Longleg actually only has four limbs. Let's tilt the arms a little bit higher. So far, so good. I think this is starting to look like her. Now, I want to make this head as round as possible. I'd say this is round enough. Now, this is going to be a bit weird to do, but I'm just going to try my best. Now, I can grab the paintbrush and make a little loop-de-loop -loop around here. Now, for the hair tie. Oh, man. Dude, this hair took way too long. But I think it's time now for the funnest part of it all. And that's to start drawing out the face. So, this part's arguably the scariest part about this whole thing and that's the eyes and to make it even more creepy i'm gonna have it like tilted like as if it's like out of socket this is so creepy looking and we could just draw on the eyelashes the necklace the outfit then for the hands and finally for her boots mommy long legs is finally done oh this took so long after the long efforts here we go mommy long legs oh my gosh oh it's so creepy wait oh look at her move uh hello mommy long legs you looking terrifying looking. Oh, just look at those eyes. It's significantly better than the last one I made, and I'm really happy with this. Uh, could you imagine just you going into a cave and you just see all of these just charging at you? I'd be terrified because this is so creepy looking. If I didn't have Fulbright on, oh, dude, nightmare fuel. Oh, and then there's Poppy. This is a little bit awkward because this version of Poppy is actually bigger than Mommy Longlegs. Oh, the way she crawls at you. Just look at that. It's so disgusting. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have added this in the game. Oh my gosh, look at him. Look at them all climb up here. Oh my gosh, that was not a good idea. This is not okay. Oh my god, where did you come from? You know what? Geronimo! 
<laughs> oh no. All right, I'm done with you. On to the next mob. Let's make Bunzo. Bunzo is one of the new characters in Poppy Playtime. And if you haven't seen him, he's actually just a really adorable yellow bunny. Let's give him those bunny cheeksters. We got to give him his big old bunny ears. This guy has two little floppy ears. Draw on his black little eyes. Now he has markings about right here. Give him his little orange cheeks. And now to slide in the buck teeth for the party hat. Now to fill in his overalls. Pull up on some buttons right here. And let's finally add his arms. And with the arms done, let's now give him his symbols. Bunzo is now complete. Time to see Bunzo. Oh, Bunzo. There we go. Hopefully you don't have any memorizing for me to do, but ah, uh, look at you. Design looks amazing. I mean, even in Minecraft, just look at him. <laughs> Wait a minute. Since this is a creeper, with this command, boom. <laughs> now it's a supercharged Bunzo. You know, for once, the aura actually matches up with the mob, kind of. Also, for a bunny, he's kind of adorable, too. However, don't be fooled by the adorableness because he will bite. Oof. I'm done. There's Bunzo. On to the next mob. Up next, we have PJ Pugapillar. This is probably gonna be so broken. For now, let's just get rid of the tail. Let's smush the nose. We're gonna have to cut up this body in half and then put in the other half right here. Now he kinda has like two parts to him. Let's get some dog ears. Now to start working on the most cursed part of this. Let's make this mouth a bit bigger. Let's color all this in. Boop on the nose. Let's get his colors down. Let's color in the first blob of the body and then the other one. Let's make the mouth. Give him his little teethers. Creepy round eyes. And now he has his tongue. So this usually Usually would be it, but he's a caterpillar, so move his body right here and give him his other legs. Oh, this is not gonna work. Okay, this is long enough. I know this isn't gonna work, but uh, here we have PJ Pug a pillar. Okay, this is awful. Okay, here we go, PJ. Oh my gosh. No, what happened to you? Okay, I think I I didn't fix anything. Oh no, those legs. So for the most part, it works, except for the legs going. Oh, um, that's not supposed to happen. Oh, uh, it's sitting down. Stop. So many legs. I just gave you like a big old butt or something. What's going on here? I can't get over this right now. I could have made you so much longer. Are you asleep? Are you kidding me right now? He's asleep. All right. Honestly, it kind of does look cute once it's like this. Oh, and now he's back up. Okay. Well, yeah, he just looks like a smaller version. That's to be expected. Oh, man. I'm gonna rank this very high in the worst mobs ever made list for me. And so for that, they must perish into the lava. Oh, no. <laughs> What's wrong with me? Next mob. And finally, let's make Boogie. Bot. I'm sorry, I got to get rid of your gobbler. So this one's a bit more wholesome looking. He's pretty much just one big adorable dancing robot. Let's give him this cute little adorable eyes right here. Kind of looks like he has a little slime on his belly. It's gonna be a bit hard to manage. He has his little arm here, but make this a bit thicker, make it green, and add a little nub right there. Let's go see how adorable he looks in Minecraft. It's time to boogie woogie. Oh, look at him move. He's moving. He's so tiny. I mean, just look at the comparison to him with the pig. I mean, I know it's a chicken, but like, ah, blowed. Oh my gosh, look at all. <laughs> Look at all the boogie bots just fall down, dude. Uh, yep, this is definitely normal. A little flying robot that has nothing to show that it's flying. Also, be sure to subscribe as we're trying to beat Kids Playtime TV to 1 million subscribers. So subscribe and help us beat them. If only the boogie bot would just boogie. Today's fan art. If you guys want to download these custom mobs, then be sure to join the Discord and subscribe to this live streaming YouTube channel.